Okay, I've signed in. So yes, here we are. Tales from the Borderlands. There's copyright music on all five episodes in this game, so yeah. So Bo Tales from the Borderlands takes place after Borderlands 2. After Handsome Jack's death. did this, and we're gonna do this one. Maybe I should have copied instead. Just like I did in the Wolf Among Us. Yeah, I'm gonna be playing through all of Telltale Games and complete all of its episodes. That's it. I do have the Minecraft Story Mode Season 1. I mean, I did. Yes, yes, season it's two. been a while. Every. Well, before. I, so, yeah. This game is old, but it's still great. I am still playing Borderlands 3, but I haven't made videos on that game. I mean, I have made videos on it, just not in a while. One knows. Ah, uh, where was I? Ah, yes. Two unlikely versions of one impossible story. The Hyperion Salary Man, who stumbled across the perfect plan to defeat his rival. But bad things can happen when you swim against fame. Hijacking the secret purchase of the ultimate prize, a vault key. Finding co-conspirators was easy. Finding real vault keys never is. Then there's the Pandoran Hustler, who conspired to sell a fake vault key. But unfortunately, plans don't often go... you know as planned. The emergency plan is used. And now, they were stuck with each other, with nothing to gamble but their lives. So, they prepared to face psychos, warlords, even vault hunters. But betrayal, no one is prepared. For betrayal. She tried to stop him, but it was too late. The money was gone, but the path to a vault key was right under their feet. Below the arena, they found the Gortis project, Atlas's crown jewel, along with a lost king. Looking to regain his throne. I'm up. Hey! I'm up. Seriously, can you use your words? You're just wasting bullets with that thing. Yeah, okay. Ah, oh, come on, you drooled on me! Huh? Oh, yeah, that's a. Wow, that's a lot. 
I am feeling a little dehydrated. <laughs> what is wrong with you? There. Now we're even. You are a monster. Stop! I'm gonna let you out of those restraints. Don't make me regret it. Because you regret it much more. Mm -hmm. Sure, yeah, okay. Yeah, we, that works for me. Let's do that. This is more about... We've got a long way to go. We should move before the sun's up. Uh, can I please hit him once? Just to get it out of my system. You gotta work on your anger management. All this animosity is not good for- Just one. What? <coughs> okay, I'm good. Good. You punched me in the neck. Let's go. Now, where were we? Well... What is it? Reese, uh, uh. buddy, you uh, you all right? You're uh, you're acting kind of weird, Reese. Later than usual. Reese is just excited. He's all right. He, you know, just probably needs some air. So, uh, upstairs, where there's more air, because it's higher, and... Hey, what's up with that map? Computer enhance! I don't think it can hear you. Oh, that's what it wants us to think. You hear me, machine? I'm on to you. Enhance. Enhance computer images! Stop it! This is not how computers work! Where are you from? You, you don't just yell enhance at the screen! Maybe I can bring up a legend on this thing. Ah! I'm okay. Did you break it? Go ahead, Fiona. Hey, Fee, trust me, you don't want to touch that. I don't understand. You and Reese are the only ones that didn't shock. Maybe they're somehow imprinted on you. Vintage Atlas. Oh, incredible! Retinal scanner online. <laughs> Security protocol engaged. Retinal scan required. Please step forward and identify yourself. Uh, maybe we should get out while we have a chance. We're not leaving until we know exactly where it's telling us to go. Please step forward and identify yourself. What's taking so long? Someone was eating food. I did play this game on the PlayStation 3 um, years ago, by the way. Man, oh man, I can't believe it. There's someone in there. What do you mean, someone? Who is it? Are they alive? No idea who it is, but they are very much not alive. Oh, craps. 
That's probably not... Wait, you hear that? Nope, I don't hear anything. Ignore it. I don't know. The computer said it was going to contact some general. You know, two plus two. Guess I should have known it'd go like this. Whoa, whoa, yeah. Ah, oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, that's exactly what I thought I was gonna see. to do is get his eye to that retinal scanner. Oh, maybe we can just scoot him over to the computer. Well, that's not gonna work. He's wedged in there pretty tight. Now what? Well, it's a retina scanner, right? We don't actually need all of him for that. Look at his uniform. Atlas military, high ranking at that. Ooh, how much he got? Not that much. Now you'd think a general would have more walking around money on him. are pretty creepy. You're basically doing him a favor. I'm not sure he would agree. <gasps> if you try to rip it out with your bare hand, you'll just end up squishing it. Uh, if you have a better idea... Any other idea would be a better idea! It's a spoon and a fork! Ha! How about that? Oh, wait, that's not... Yep. The eye's gotta come out one way or another. Okay, this is... Okay. Yeah, yeah, you, you gotta do it. I, I gotta do it. I gotta do it, so I just... Man, how long has it been since I played this game? It's been like forever. No. Many years has it. I'm not sure. Just shove that into his face. Why do you have to say it like that? I'm just saying. Did you just do it already? Okay. <sighs> Why did that just happen? Oh man, you split the eye right in half. All the juice from the thing. Why are you describing it to me? I know, I did it. Right, sorry. Look, all I'm saying is, you got one more shot. Right, because he's got two eyes. One eye, now. You've got a knack for numbers, don't you? I'll just wait over there. Here we go. Right, so far so good. Stop talking to me. Hey, I can't tell if that's looking better or looking worse. It's looking way worse. Trust me. If you're gonna puke, do it on the floor, please. This is me helping. Ooh. Jesus. Oh, you, almost, you almost got it. Just cut the thing. Holding it to the, the thing. Look 
Thank you. Hey, and you didn't crush it. I totally would have crushed it. Let's just get this thing over to the What? Okay. Enter. Oh. Okay, what do we got? The Ringa. The Ringa. Skull Mask. Gordis Half. Eyeball. Yeah. Message one. Athena. <laughs> Gortis facility. Old Haven. Hello, Pollux. Too bad I missed you in Old Haven. As you've no doubt surmised, the Gortis project has been terminated. And now that you have no soldiers under your command, I regret to inform you that you've been relieved of your duties. I'll come by soon to ease your transition into retirement. Uh, what's Old Haven? It's an Atlas mining town. It's been abandoned for years. Which makes it the perfect place to hide a Gordas project. Whatever that is. Old Haven. Message to General Pollux. Memorandum. If you're watching this, then I'm already in suspended animation. You must understand, Athena was trying to kill me. And what I possess is far too powerful to end up in the arsenal of a ruthless mercenary. If Athena is no longer a threat, please activate the revival protocol in my stasis dock. My life and quite possibly the fate of the universe is in your hands. Revival? Whoa. Oh no. Does that mean he was... Oh, when you scooped... Oh, nah. No we way. Killed. No. No, he had to be dead when we... Don't. Killed. Just... Don't. Wait. So, I guess we're going to Old Haven. Reese, you want to take a look at the... <laughs> oh, ouch. I'm fine. Do you need our help? No, I'm, I'm good. Oh. Oh. Wait, what? I didn't hit my head. What are you talking about? I saw you hit that girder. No, 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 no. I, I, I hit my head on that, but I didn't hit my head when I fell into the computers. And obviously there wasn't a geyser of blood. There was quite a bit of blood. This is all fascinating, very thorough. But what about Jack? Oh, right. Jack. And this, ladies and gentlemen, is the Gordis Project. And it's gonna lead us to a vault. And then I'll probably kill you. <laughs> what? Okay. Here's what's gonna happen. You, uh... I'm sorry. What's your name again? Come on. Spit it out, dum-dum. I don't have all day. Oh, good. You work for me. I thought, I thought I was gonna help you, but...
yeah, I know, I'm your hero, you're my biggest fan, blah, 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 welcome to the club. Just try to fight yourself, you might short yourself back down. Alright, take notes, kiddo, I'm not one to repeat myself. Our first step is secure the area. Right, not enough to attract bandits, just enough to keep out the gawkers. Jack, what? This is impossible. Jack, you're... You're dead. Uh, I'm dead? I'm sorry, what's that supposed to mean? Are you threatening me, little man? Huh? No, 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 no. Why ah! did that just happen? Um... Oh, shut up. Are you screaming because you're in pain, or are you just freaking out because this is really weird? Because it, it is, it is weird. Would you please stop doing that? This is, this doesn't make any sense. Yeah. Stand still, damn it. Stop doing that! It's like I told you. Handsome Jack is dead. No, 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 no. That's impossible. You tried to destroy me because he tried to destroy me. Possibly. I, I can't die. It's, it, no, 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 it's, it's stupid. No way. Look, you kind of deserved it, Jack. I'm sorry. Deserved it? I brought order to this pisshole of a planet. No, no, no. Whatever your intentions really were, you, you went way too far. Oh, you can't even begin to understand my intentions. You think I haven't had to make sacrifices? Too many people die. Too many people die! Give me a break! That's what people do! No, 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 no. I'm, I'm, I'm handsome, Jack. <laughs> I don't die. Hey, there's too much left to do. I'm not, not happening. Not happening. Hey, give me a cupcake. Just let me try to rip your throat out one more time. Just one more time. Give me a... What? No, no! Uh, you see, I think I just gotta be quicker about it. That's what it is. Stand still, damn it. Jack, you're dead. Deal with it. Killing people, that's how I deal with things. Come on, just, just, just let it happen. <laughs> you're so stupid. Watch your head do it. Do you need our help? Oh! Freeze! So much. Pain? Why am I still conscious? I don't understand. Reese, hey, you all right? What the hell are you doing? I, I know that sounds weird, but I just, I just saw Handsome Jack. What are you saying? Handsome Jack, he was, he was next to me. Right. Okay. Well, you had quite a spill there. Let's just get you up off this thing. Here you go. You know, these fumes can't possibly be helping. Oh, I must be pretty out of it. I'm seeing stars. Shooting stars. Moonshots. Moonshots? Really? Moonshots? We need to get out of here! when we get back. But we have to not die right now. We used up our boost getting out of there. How long till it recharges? A few minutes at least. Give me the wheel. What? Why? Uh, I'm not hearing a good reason. That's what I thought. I can dodge the moonshots. That's impossible. Not if I know where they're gonna land. Then what? We'll go to Hollow Point. They can't track us there. 
You better know what you're doing. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Just keep us alive until that thing is full and then we can boost out of here. Got it? Yeah, I got it. I got it. I don't got it!
they still fall out if you grab them. Everything from the caravan is gone. So yeah. things that might kill us keeps getting longer. I hadn't even thought about moonshots. Racks, skags, bandits, dehydration, heat stroke, regular stroke, 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 whatever that is, that murder pile. The list just keeps getting longer. I've never felt so alive! <laughs> this is awesome! I can't imagine going back to financial reports. Ugh, boring! Come on, Vaughn. I can't afford to be reckless. We're barely getting through this as it is. It's not about being reckless. It's about getting past the fear. This! This is what I'm talking about! Mixing it up with Hyperion. Teaming up with grifters? Come on! These are the types of stories we'll tell our children when we're millionaires! We just survived moonshots from Hyperion! Huh? Friggin' moonshots, man! I am not afraid anymore! You hear me, Hyperion? I am Vaughn, and I am not afraid! Yeah, what the hell was that? Relax, it's a vet. Oh, okay. I have to pee. And not because I was scared. I, I had to go anyway. This is perfect timing. Freeze, you're alive. <sighs> Thank God you guys are okay. I thought that was it for a second there. I am so relieved. So, thanks for the warning. Trust me. I tried. I did. Tell her to send some supplies! Yeah, don't talk to me while you're peeing. Thank you. Sorry! Almost done! Anyway, I got them to stop shooting, but I can't keep Vasquez from wanting to take you guys out. I'm doing what I can, but it's chaos up here. We could use some wheels. Vasquez's car is long gone. Oh, and we're stranded out here in the desert. Look, I'm able to track you, so stay safe for now. I'll send what I can. Cool. Hopefully she can help us out. We can't be walking through the desert too long. I mean, not without water. <laughs> Go through all this and die of dehydration would be pretty lame. Uh, fun? Should I be calling a doctor? What? Why? What's happening? Because you are all cut up. <laughs> what? what? Am I bleeding? Where? No, what? You're weirdly buff. I put an exercise bike in my office a few months ago. Don't worry about it. Right. He is pretty young. <laughs> I gotta say, I'm a little envious of the definition he's got going. He's saving the world. It doesn't leave you much time for the gym. Could you stop sneaking up on me? Who's sneaking? I don't sneak. Oh, so you've been here this whole time? Yeah. Oh. Reese, who are you talking to? So he definitely can't see me, right? You're kind of freaking me out, Reese. Hey, so... Remember earlier when uh, I said I could see Handsome Jack? Sure, right after you fell off the ledge. <laughs> oh, yeah, right. Well, it's true. Uh, he's standing right next to you. Right. 
Right. So, handsome... <laughs> handsome Jack is standing next to me. Yes. And I can't see him, but you're able to see him and also talk to him. Correct. He definitely thinks you're crazy. Who exactly is this little muscle-bound tool? <laughs> I'm not crazy. <laughs> okay. Ask him how many fingers I'm holding up. Uh, I don't know if he's scratching his ass and, uh... Oh! God, I think he may have pissed on his shirt. That's not yeah, clean. How many? Three. Three. You're holding up three fingers. Lucky... Yes. You know it's not. Come on. We should get out of the sun. I... I don't understand. You should have joined the club. James. Let's go. I can't tell if I'm crazy or you're crazy. Yeah, I don't know what state of being uh, I'm in right now, but, uh... Well, walking still sucks. What are the odds? What does he mean? Yeah, what do you mean? I mean, of all the people in the universe, Handsome Jack would be appearing to, it just happens to be the guy who's totally obsessed with him. <laughs> it's crazy! It's like destiny. Uh, what? So should I be creeped out right now? Because I'm feeling a little creeped out. This is just a coincidence, Vaughn. Men make their own destiny. You sound like Vasquez. You sound, uh, like you're dodging the question. Uh, you obsessed with me, Cupcake? I mean, think about it. You got all those handsome Jack posters in your office, dude. I think that's a little weird. That makes two of us. Yeah, those are motivational posters. You like a cat hanging? They're Hyperion issued. Well, maybe it has something to do with the Nakayama drive. Namiyaka. Why does that sound familiar? No, I did shove a bunch of data, you know, straight into my head. Uh, Nakayama, right. The weirdo that was obsessed with me. The other weirdo that was obsessed with me. Oh, man. Hyperion would kill to get their hands on this. This? You! Your head or body or whatever Jack is in. Yeah, they would, wouldn't they? Whatever version of Jack you've got in there, Nakayama stored it for a reason. Damn right, even this idiot gets Hyperion it. Hyperion would scour the ends of Pandora to get it. We can't take Jack back to Hyperion. What? No, 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 you need to get me back to here. Yeah, Helios. you're probably right. No, no, you are definitely wrong. This is torture, that's, that's what it is. I'm in hell. This is what hell is. <laughs> it's about time. That's gotta be Yvette. I'm tired of walking. That makes two of us. Uh-oh! Incoming! <laughs> it's coming right for us. Hey, I guess that tracker's working, huh, boys? It's coming right <laughs> for us! Go to Papa! meeting you two here. Here I was, out for a nice drive, and I land right on just the guys I was looking for. How did you find us, Hugo? Oh, ho, ho. <laughs> You're Hyperion property, Reese. Hyperion doesn't lose track of its property. Look, I know we had a deal. Well, I don't like to go back on an agreement made man-to-man. -man. Hey, I that's right! We did have a deal! 
You convinced me to double-cross my best friend, and the day isn't even over before you're double-crossing me? Oh. <laughs> oh, man. When you put it like that, it does sound awful. Yeah. Honey, I get it. Maybe we should try to take this a little more seriously. Should've known better than to trust a snake like you. Don't be like that, little guy. It's just the way of the, uh... Listen, I'm gonna go see if I got a shirt in the truck, because your body is making me uncomfortable. Mm. Hold tight, kids. Look, I told him I would sell you out, but I swear I wasn't gonna do it. I was just saying whatever he wanted to hear to jerk off our backs. I wasn't gonna follow through with it. Please believe me. I he offered me the deal, too. Really? What did you tell him? What's that? They're shovels, genius. You two freaks start digging. I want to see a decent grave going before too long. You heard me. Don't make me tell you again. <laughs> You're gonna pay for this. You'll see. Yeah, because we have friends. Dangerous friends that will hunt you down to the ends of Pandora. Well, that... that, uh, that sounds exhausting. Well, I guess it's a good thing I'll be leaving this ball of hot garbage real soon. <clears throat> what part of Dig don't you understand? Let's get going, Mr. Universe! Okay, just don't shoot! There you go, a little hard work. <laughs> to be fair, that was supposed to hit you. Wait. Wait! <laughs> oh. 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 Damn. Damn, that smarts. I think I did that. Yeah, the guy who plays as Vasquez is Joe from Family Guy. That's insane. Man, Troy Baker. I mean. Yeah, Troy, who plays as Reese, his acting well, okay. is great. You get a tough voice nugget. acting. Looks so easy in the movies. Amateur hour, you gotta aim for the bridge of the nose, dumb dumb. How is it every time I show up, you idiots are in a worse situation? <laughs> You're not helping. <laughs> All right, fun's over. Looks like we'll be settling for the shallow variety of grave. Reese, you die first, and then he can load your body in the car. I'll bury Vaughn myself. What? Yeah, they want this idiot's body for something up there. Something, uh, important floating around in his head. This is a prototype. The most advanced gun Hyperion has ever made. Someone's overcompensating. Any last words before the inevitable end of your You don't even know how to use that thing. Maybe you should have read the manual, huh? Manuals are for amateurs. Damn it. Uh, is there a problem? Yeah, I know how to shoot a gun. I just want to get the maximum damage out of this thing. Okay, look, as much as I'd love to watch this idiot kill you two idiots, I can't let that happen. I'm, I'm inside of, I'm not inside you, but I'm like, look, if you go, I go. I've enhanced your Echo Eye, so use it to hack something and get us the hell out of this jam. Figure out how you can pay me back later. I've got you back. Right. Okay, mess this guy up. Hack his car. Hack his gun. Solid. Give yourself system access. Is it's new. Button on a gun, you can do. Push this in. Push this in, and nothing's happening. Hell the hell? Ow!
What are you doing with your hands? Uh, uh, I'm, I'm not doing that. Oh, hello. <laughs> this is an interesting little development. Fine, look, we gotta go. This is my head! Get out! Oh, come on, don't be like that. Oh, oh you see, you see what you did? You hit your... Race! Yeah, go ahead and run. You're just making this funner for me. meet him in Old Haven, get a head start, or we could always just go to Hollow Point, though that might be dangerous. Man, this is a big decision. <laughs> so we're gonna it's go weird, to... but I, I always... So we're gonna go to Old Haven, which was... which a lot of players went to in Borderlands 1. Which came back in Tales from the Borderlands. This is uh, cool. You know, talk to myself during, you know, huge choices. It's just something I do, and I, I know it's just, you know, super important. I, I'm not talking to you, I'm, I'm talking to me right now, so. Yeah. We'll meet them at Hollow Point, then we'll go together, like a family. Sounds good. To Hollow Point. I got one. We should probably let him finish. Fine. I'm curious. Why would you choose to go to Hollow Point? What was there to gain? I'm growing impatient. Well, despite what you might call a lack of skill, I moved up through the ranks at Hyperion fairly quickly. Straight to the middle. And I've been able to do that because of one thing. And one thing only, loyalty. As evidenced by your former boss trying to kill you. We all have our reasons. And I suppose yours are good enough. If they were, we wouldn't be here. A man can only take so much. Luckily, you're a safe distance from a man. <laughs> we were stranded in the desert. You had a car. Did you even consider coming to get us? We had our own... One of you will have to change a tire.
can't believe we made it. Do you think the guys will be okay? I'm sure they'll figure something out, probably. But, um, the Badlands are practically a graveyard. Well, they'll be alright. In the heat? With the skags? I'm not so sure. They probably called for help and had someone pick them up. Yeah, probably. caravan like this. We couldn't help him if we wanted to. I hope he'll fix it. We're not exactly rolling in cash right now. How are you gonna get him to do it? I mean, I'm assuming it's not exactly a charity. And we definitely cannot get out of here if we don't get this fixed. He's a mark, just like any other, and every mark has their angle. Find the angle and they'll do whatever you want. I guess that's true. We'll figure it out, don't worry. Stay here. I'll do the talking. Wouldn't have it any other way. Every mechanic have to be gross. Scooter's a fan of the races. Good to know. That race was insane. Rest in peace, Bossanova. Leaving me <laughs> out like this. I almost feel sorry for the poor sap. Almost. Man, I gotta cut down my wrench budget. Oh. oh, hey, man, welcome to Skitter's Catch a Ride. What can we do for you today? Uh, sorry if I seem a little dis distracted. Uh, hopefully, handing this place over to the new proprietor today, and I gotta get all these numbers and stuff in order. No, it's a lot. I don't know if you know this, but the transition from small business owner to friend. Oh, this is a really nice looking place you have here, Scooter. Oh, thanks, man. It means a lot. Business has been a little slow so far, you know, being in a hidden cave town and everything. But I'll pick up. <laughs> Hope it picks up, though. Holy crap. I knew I recognized this rig from somewhere. You were in the latest Bossin' Over Death Rally. Oh, I was there, man. Did you see me? I was, I was waving. You were a badass. How about we just figure out how to get it fixed? Hmm? Oh, all right, man. A little bit hostile, but that's cool. That's cool. That thing's beat up to hell and back, man. I could fix it, but it's probably gonna run you about 2,500 cold. 2,500? Uh, that's a little out of my price range. Not to be implied or nothing, but you must have won a buttload of money from that race, right? Where did it all go? Oh, cuz my cousin, right? He said that his sister's friend's neighbor's husband won one of them races one time, and the cats kept them fed for weeks. Yeah, someone stole it. Can you believe that? Yes, actually. Yes, I can. Well, tell me this. You think you could ever see yourself racing again? Let me pitch you something, and it might be crazy, but if you keep racing, I would love to endorse you as a sponsor. What do you say? It'll be great, maybe like a billboard, a couple commercials, product placement. Scooter, sir, you have yourself a deal. Yeah? Oh man, this is awesome! You will not regret this, no way, no how, man! That earth! Say it once for me, man, you know? The catchphrase? Catch a ride! You know it. Come on. Don't be shy. I'm your sponsor now. Gotta hear how you do the catchphrase. Yeah, no. No, no, not now. No? All right. 
Well, I guess there's no harm in saving it for the real deal. Ah, uh, would have been cool. I'm thinking that we put a big old ad on your van, you know, like maybe a picture of me with like, catch a ride up above it, you know, all cool ride. I'm looking all badass for you to put some badass pictures of you with your car and your hat and all that. Hi, Scooter, right? Everything going okay? <laughs> I was, uh, I was just gonna, you know, go grab the paperwork, let me take care of that. Okay, bye. Alright, man, here's my standard endorsement contract. Don't mind the sub clauses about uh, explosions and whatnot. I might have copied it from Torque. Anyway, I figure as long as I'm in there and you're yeah, doing it for free, maybe you want to splurge and get some of the special packages. I got some good ones. I know it's a big decision. You go ahead and take your time. A lot of good choices, I know, I know. Real classy ones, too. Sometimes I just stand here and stare at him, you know? I know how it is. That one would look badass as hell, man. Take it from me. The badass from hell. Man, to be you right now, that is some fine taste, man. Like a treat for yourself and for me getting to do it. Can't wait. Come on in, man. We'll get her all hooked up and get to work. Oh, crap. This doesn't look good. Hey, fellas. What can I do you for? Oh. I just hope that little deal you two struck is enough to get him to look the other way. Okay, listen. If things go sour, get ready to run. I'll be right behind you. I'll take the high ground, you cover the back end. Only if it comes to it. I don't teach him. Hope you ladies weren't too scared. Just doing my duty to keep ruffians the crap out of my garage. I'm a real protector type. Who were those guys? Man, just some wannabe tough guys trying to shake down a local business owner. You know how it is. Yeah, they looked pretty dangerous to me. Yeah, they probably could have killed me, but I look death in the face a lot. Like all the time. Like, hey, death, how you doing? No big deal. Seems like there's some bad men looking for you two, though. You got a place to lay low while I'm getting your ride all fixed up? And I don't think Felix is as too far away. If we're careful, we can make it on foot. Then, let's do it.